Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a significant leap forward for South Korea's ambitious KF-21 fighter jet program, Deal Defense has announced the successful completion of the first guided test firing of the Iris-T short-range air-to-air missile, AIM-2000. This achievement, realized through collaboration between Korea Aerospace Industries, KAI, and Deal Defense, underscores the technological prowess and dedication driving South Korea's indigenous fighter jet initiative. The recent milestone, attained during the development phase of the KF-21, marks a pivotal moment in the program's progression. Building upon earlier successes such as the aircraft's maiden flight in early 2023 and subsequent safe separation tests, this latest feat demonstrates the KF-21's growing capabilities in air-to-air -air combat scenarios. The KAI KF-21 Borame, a testament to South Korea's commitment to advancing military aviation technology, is poised to become a formidable asset in the nation's defense arsenal. With a wingspan of 11.2 meters, a length of 16.9 meters, and a height of 4.7 meters, the KF-21 is powered by two F414-400K dual-flow turbojet engines, enabling speeds of up to 2,250 km per hour and an operational range of 1,000 km. Moreover, the successful integration of the Iris-T missile further enhances the KF-21's combat capabilities. As Europe's most advanced short-range air-to-air missile, the Iris-T brings cutting-edge technology and precision to aerial engagements. Its compatibility with the KF-21 opens new possibilities for the aircraft's role in safeguarding South Korea's airspace and fulfilling its operational objectives. The collaboration between KAI and Deal Defense underscores the importance of international partnerships in advancing defense capabilities. Since 2017, both entities have worked diligently to ensure the seamless integration of the Iris-T missile into the KF-21 platform, culminating in this successful test firing. Helmut Rauch, CEO of Deal Defense, commended KAI for its exceptional performance in the development of the KF-21 program and expressed pride in Deal Defense's contribution to this milestone achievement. The successful live firing from the KF-21 not only validates the aircraft's air-to-air -air capabilities but also showcases the effectiveness of the Iris-T missile system. Looking ahead, plans are underway to further integrate the Iris-T into KAI's fa 50 expanding the reach of this advanced missile system across multiple platforms. This move underscores the versatility and adaptability of the Iris-T, which has already been integrated into various combat aircraft worldwide, including the Panavia Tornado, Eurofighter Typhoon, JAS-39 Gripen, F-16, EF-18, and F-5. As South Korea continues to invest in indigenous defense capabilities, the successful test firing of the Iris-T from the KF-21 serves as a testament to the nation's technological prowess and commitment to safeguarding its sovereignty. With the KF-21 on track to be operational by 2026, South Korea is poised to assert its position as a key player in the global defense landscape, equipped with cutting-edge aircraft and advanced missile systems to meet evolving security challenges. That's all for now, see you later.